tonight. Okay, we're sticking with the lovely Pure Gold Pineapple Clan to present the next award, which is the best national school-aged activity. And our finalists are Girl Guides Australia. <laughs> Grasshopper Soccer. NAB AFL Auskick. <laughs> Netball Australia. Scouts Australia. And Tennis Australia Hotshots. And the winner is Girl Guides Australia. On behalf of Girl Guides Australia, thank you so, so very much. And Pineapple Joe, you're the best. And Debella Coffee, I mean, seriously, is there another coffee? No! So thank you, thank you, thank you. Do you know, Elise, you're just amazing. Fancy putting together something like this, where we all have a passion and a commitment to help little girls, to help little boys to help young people grow up to be strong and resilient and confident and listen to what we do in this room together. You know, all of us together. What can I tell you about Girl Guides? Our mission is to empower little girls to grow up to be strong and confident and resilient so they can make informed decisions about who they are, whether they want to be the baker or the leader or whatever they want to be, to feel proud of who they are, to be able to make informed decisions. We have a badge system. What is that? That means we get them to challenge themselves, not about competing with others, but to have a go. If you fail, learn the lesson and move on, because there's lots of things that we can do. I could tell you a million things. Do you know this weekend, we have Voices Against Violence program happening. We are piloting. I'm the Australian sponsor. And so we have a pilot program, it's from our world stage of World Guides, World Association of Girl Guides, and it's funded by Zonta, developed with United Nations. And we are in the non-pointy end, the awareness end. So we are the largest girls and women's organization in the world. And so we have young girls, I know. Um, <laughs> and we are helping them understand what's acceptable behavior and what is not, and to understand what their values are. So we have seven-year-olds saying, well, that's not right, is it? And so they are doing take action projects. They're going to, one of the girls went to her principal and said, I didn't know that, that other girls don't live like me. So they're having an orange day at their school. Like, there's a million things that we do. Oh, thank you so much. Um, <laughs> We are volunteer-led and volunteer-owned. I have my own business, but I am the very proud State Commissioner of Girl Guides Queensland, which means I chair the Girl Guides Queensland Board, which means I'm a director on the Australian Board. Who wouldn't want to be part of an organisation that helps little girls grow up to know who they are and to have a sense of being and to know how to say yes and no? Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs>